If you're looking to get out this afternoon, we have an idea for you. The Minnesota Zoo is back open to the public after being closed for months. Susan Elizabeth Littlefield is live at the zoo this afternoon. It's an exciting day for the people and for all those animals as well. Hey, Sus. That's exactly right, Allie. Hey, you know, I'm smiling right now. You can't tell, but trust me, I am. And a lot of people were smiling today. Those zoo regulars excited to get back. It's been four long months and the animals too are getting a lot more attention today. Hey, I know you don't want to see me right now, so I'm going to step out of the way so you can look at what's over my shoulder right here. You see that camel right there. He is enjoying a dip in the water. That forecast Mike was talking about, he is on top of it right in the water and then up the hill right there you can see another camel we want to show you some other video we got this morning the zoo opened to an eager crowd at 10 o'clock masks are required and people came prepared there is lots to look at for zoo patrons the snow monkeys are on display they were enjoying the sunshine there was also a russian bear taking a rest right out in that sunshine and and these guys are about to see, they're called Takins. They were in the sun. They're kind of like wildebeest. So there is a lot to look at today, but the rules are a little bit different. We are requiring masks of all of our staff and guests, age three and up. We have hand sanitizer placed throughout the zoo. We are, as part of that ticketing where you purchase online, we are scanning through a window so there is no contact with our guest service staff at this time. And then we have to take into account the safety of our animals as well. Yeah, and you guys might remember at the Bronx Zoo, they had some cases of animals contracting COVID-19. So they're taking extra precautions, distancing the animals more than they usually do from the people. Now, as we mentioned, if you want to get tickets, you can only get them online. There's a touchless system, so you can't buy them in person. We've got a link on WCCO.com slash links alley. Okay, Susan Elizabeth, you enjoy your afternoon at the zoo. Thank you.